back to round two of PTL Open 3. Uh, we've got Reese J uh, as player. He's our player one, is that right? Uh, Brendan's actually player oh, one. Reese is player two. All right. So Reese J is a uh, player two, and Brendan C O or O is our uh, playing Rebels this round. PTL open format where you bring three lists and you choose one to play. Just try to play all your lists. Get bonus tournament points for that. So we've all rocks. So in this matchup, Ketsu is loving that. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So let's just go over the lists real quickly. So if you would uh, just want to run down the upgrades they've got. So yeah. Let's go over Brendan's list first because he's player one. We got that I can hold it forever, infinite regen Jack Portkins, which is super cute. <laughs> uh, the uh, chopper obviously able to spend the charge off elusive, and then uh, Jack able to regen that at elusive charge every single time. That'll be interesting to see how often he can proc that, if at all, but it's it's awesome in theory. Yep. And we got Garvin, which we're seeing a lot of in uh, 4x builds or 3x builds because, of course, his, his ability is very synergistic. Oh, um, yeah. And he packs a punch, and he's got a good uh, initiative order as well. Crack shot's never a bad choice, and R4 makes sense. Uh, Biggs is Biggs. We were no slush to seeing him in almost every single, not every single Rebel list, but you always see him in lists like this. Oh, makes yeah. sense. Staple. And the absolute staple here, the half Rock and Leia Organa. Everyone's yeah. favorite princess. Yeah. And then over here, Reese is rocking uh, Ketsu Onyo, who if he's got his arcs overlapped, he gets to do fun things with Tractor Beam. It is a sad, sad day for anybody <laughs> in range one of Ketsu's front arc. Yeah, equipped with the staple to him, Fearless, and Forlom, which is just makes it all the, all the worse for who has ever is lined up a shot on. Contraband Cybernetics and Shadowcaster. Just uh, basically the killing machine version of Ketsu. Mm -hmm. And then uh, not so much the uh, killing machine it was in 1.0, but we've got AG88B yeah. hitting the table today with the double... Uh, Cannons, tractor beam, and auto blaster, and the marksmanship to proc the auto blaster trick Absolutely. always, which makes a lot of sense. We've been seeing that a lot on B wings and stuff yep. like that as well. And then contraband cybernetics, which he will make good use of. And then the staple of the scum faction these days, uh, Torkoal Mux, mm -hmm. going to choose one lucky winner to be zero agility. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I mean we were, f we were finding a lot of people when when. Um, Palab went up in price, it was yep. kind of like, sure, I could just make your I6 and I0, and it's the yep. same thing. Yeah, and with the Jedi coming in, Force users so strong, it's mm -hmm. like Palab lost a lot of value. It's mm -hmm. like, I don't care if I don't have green tokens, because, mm -hmm. you know, I've got purple tokens. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Torkoal is a really solid choice. I love the uh, the Prox Mines. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah. No turret, so no title, no nothing like that. Mm -hmm. So he's, he's really he feels like he's there for utility mm -hmm. and to get those mines off if, if he can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, Torkoal doesn't have a turret. He's got the built-in, uh, but he doesn't have the 18-point yeah. moldy crow. Yeah. And you'll notice that our uh, ship icons are a little bit off today, but that's part of the craziness of the PTL Open. Uh, we wanted to keep you guessing. <laughs> um, but so no, of course, uh, with a little bit of a technical thing with, uh, with the live recording, so the icons of the ships won't match, but that's okay. It's more fun to think of IG-88 in a uh, Interceptor. Yeah. So it looks like we're ready to rock. We're revealing dials off the races. All right. Hef is going to put a little bit of space. Yeah, I don't think Brendan wants anything to do with that huge <laughs> asteroid pile. Like, I don't, I don't, I think he's just like, nope. Yeah. I feel like he's going to want to make Reese come out of that asteroid field because that's, yeah. He's gonna, he wants to be able to use the K turns. He wants to be able to use the zero stop rotates, the proc on the Leia. Yeah. And he doesn't want to be anywhere near those rocks. Absolutely. So this is going to be a great match. It's I like, wonder if Reese is going to bring Ketsu right there, the hard three, and just jam her down and get in there. Probably. Probably. I think that's a good call because that's exactly where Ketsu wants to be. It's a great lane for her to be in, right? Yeah. And IG is fast enough to keep up with the Shadowcaster as well. Yeah. I think, they, I think he's probably going to go with a flank with the IG, mm -hmm. but, you know... Anything's possible because IGs, you know, haven't seen them in a while. They could be up to other things. Looks like Brendan is also rocking the world. Yes. Uh, Rogue Squadron or Red Squadron. Those are so nice. As well as the mirrored 
Uh, focus tokens, very nice. He was part of the raiding party that we sent down on the shuttle to Durium. Or no, we ch what was it called? It was the... Um, Canada House? Yeah, he was in the old rocket yeah. Canada House. Yeah, he won his uh, invitation to Worlds uh, winning uh, the hyperspace trial at the at our Toronto System Open. Mm -hmm. It was great. Oh, one straight. Okay, so just keeping it, not going to overcommit there. No need to decide yet. He still has the hard two next round if he needs it. Yeah. Yeah, but lots of asteroids just spread out well. The you're going to be able to make use of those no matter where it happens, unless it. Brendan's able to stay exactly <laughs> where he is in that area in the asteroid free zone. Yeah. What do you think? When you're flying a Katsu, do you think uh, the propensity is to like bunch up all the rocks close together to make a to make it scary for ability? But I, I kind of wonder, it might be better to have them more spread out to mm -hmm. give you more opportunities to use your ability on more options, right? Because it makes threats in, in much more areas. Yeah. And I think also Reese is thinking that he's wanting to... Uh, Put that prox mine yes. or prox mines. Clogging uh, up even more lanes. Yeah, clog up the lanes and just maybe get that lucky uh, tractor onto the prox mine. Oh, right. Didn't which Brendan fully aware of, I'm sure. Just going to try his best not to make that happen. But that's what scum does. It just like just does things. Uh, they kind of force know. you to play their game. <laughs> exactly. This is interesting. Yeah, how do you approach this then if you're Brennan? Because there's so much going on in Reese's list that you just don't want to be around it. He's got yeah. so many like nope zones. Yeah. yeah. So I think that probably Brendan's game is going to be just to choose, uh, you know, isolate where he can, try to eliminate. And then once it's, once he's eliminated a ship, then it's going to be a lot, uh, a lot easier for him. He's got, because he's ba built a tank. He's got these these re beefy ships doing what rebels do, mm -hmm. <laughs> and they're just going to be able to withstand. So Brendan has par procced Leia. Yep, and did a course, zero stop, yeah. closes pivot wings, yep. and half is doing a spin ruse. Yep. Yep, that Leia reposition strong. Mm -hmm. Also, now is a good time for him to do that because oh, okay. so, it feels like the next engagement will happen within two to three turns. So he know Brennan knows his lay will be ready to rock yeah. when he needs it again the next turn. Exactly. And there, Reese is also just holding Torkel back with a zero as well. Okay. There we go. Biggs is getting up there, closing some distance. Getting into formation there. Do you think Jack will jump the line and go in front of half or probably stay behind him <laughs> with the one forward? I think he'll probably just want to hang back for yeah. now. Probably. But you know, he could jump. Oh, okay, he is, gonna he make is, it past. He okay. is doing it. Okay. X wings in front. Mm, okay, so I'm going to try to run nice away from Ketsu and pick on Torkel and IG over there. You think you think Brandon wants to get rid of Torkel as soon as possible? Well, he's the softest target, mm -hmm. uh, especially without the Moldy Crow. Uh, I don't think his ability is that uh, overpowered in this list, but it just... You know, if you're picking targets, you know. It might be the easiest one. To might be out. the easiest one. And, you know, if you can get rid of IG instead, okay. But also, definitely yeah. not going to just take the bait and try to take on Ketsu. Yeah. The ship destroyer. Yeah. <laughs> so Reese has a 5K with his Ketsu. Okay. Going to be able to use those big, big blue moves that Ketsu has. The hard three three bank. I loop. think he's played this list once or twice before. One, once or twice. <laughs> it feels like it. That's a nice move. That's gonna set him up for a beautiful three bank into that lane. Yeah. And just be able to hold him back enough. Yeah. But. That's always the trick with Ketsu is is uh holding or in any shadow caster really holding it off. 
because mm-hmm. it's so fast. Yeah. I mean, it does have the one forward now, doesn't it? It does. I, don't know, I think that IG's wishing he was able to just hold off, but mm, he's going to have to get in. <laughs> he's uh, he's going to be engaging. Maybe he'll be able to use make use of his tractor beam. Often uh, a throwaway t- uh, cannon, but so might be able to make the, good use of it. Because of the title, the IG can tractor first shot pull you in. Right. Oh, but it's only if you miss. It's only if you miss. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah, so you can't do any shenanigans like that where you could pull it in and then use the uh, auto blaster. Yeah, still lots of shenanigans to be had though, but it's, it doesn't do any damage unless you're able to capitalize on it. So, and the card states that you can use and when you miss an attack, you can use a secondary weapon. So you could use a tractor beam twice. Yeah, if you miss and you could, if you're yeah. really important for you to put someone on that rock. Yeah, and, and then, then also with tractor beam, it will just do tractor tokens is yeah. damage so you could as potentially tractor large or uh medium based ships mm-hmm. move them into places they really don't want to be it's also point in, important to note that ketsu can tractor anything on the field right now because the medium base u-wing with her ability and the shadow yep. title could absolutely could, do, put, could put half on a rock Absolutely. And I think Brendan's got to be very careful with Jack coming in this way because if IG just goes one forward or one bank, that rock is a problem for Jack. Yeah, could be. Could Potentially. Be. Could be, but he's got... I think that, that if that happens, that's exactly what Brendan wants because, okay, Tractrum, mm-hmm. he's going to be able to bring down all the fire because, it's, yeah, I don't know if uh, Reese will be able to get Ketsu up to be able to be part of that fight to keep uh ig from taking some serious shots you know that's the that's the the two-way rub of the the zero damage cannon mm-hmm. you know mm-hmm. okay you did you already did some funny stuff to me hilarious but guess what it didn't did hurt no damage and now i'm true. gonna i'm gonna make you pay <laughs> all right so wings opening thank yep. you brendan for so vigilantly making it easy for us to follow <laughs> and uh m- manipulating the s- what are they called? What are they called on a U-wing? Are they called wings? They're pivot wings. They they're do call them wings. wings. Yeah, they're okay. not S-foils. They're pivot wings. I watched Rogue One recently, and they really didn't use them at all that much. It was no. just like, didn't matter what they were doing. It was like, yeah, fighting, not fighting. Yeah, let's just... Like, I think it was just a cool design. Yeah, just a cool thing. And then they're closed. It makes it look like a U. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cool-looking ship, though. Yeah. It's gotten... It's very good in, the, in 2.0. It's really seen its its uh, time in the sun here. Yeah. That's a nice wall of fire Brendan set up there. I don't know. That's a, that's a difficult to escape wall of fire that he has set up there. Yeah. All three dice guns. Yeah. All pointing in the right direction. Yeah. And see that that rock is of no consequence. Yeah. I, li- I like Brendan's approach a lot. All right. That is a heavy concentration of guns. And IG, what are you going to do? Going to have to tank some shots there. He could boost for an auto blaster shot, but he won't be out of arc, so it's probably not worth it. That yep. makes more sense. So he gets his calculate tokens. Here comes Ketsu. Is three, three bank, bank or yeah. three hard? Three bank. Yeah. There she oh, is. Oh, remember the days of engine upgrade? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Engine upgrade or burnout slam. Those were the days. Those the were, dark days. <laughs> those were Ketsu's fun times. Yeah. All right. Okay, so, All right, so Brendan's triggering Garvin. Yeah. Torkel out of range to be able to use his ability. Mm-hmm. That moldy crow upgrade is... It's just too good, so you know. So he didn't just didn't include it. Didn't really think he needed it. Thought he could do without it. Uh, oh, the focus for three hits. The power of the focus. The three eyeball conversion. Mm-hmm. All right. So IG. Two shields. Burn off. There we go. So two shields off of. Poor old IG. First blood. IGB. 
Having a sad droid time over there. So Coven was out of range, and then Jack just put away three damage, two damage into the yep. IG. So he's just weighing his options to see who he wants to fire at. Do you want to shoot at? Okay, he's going to fire his tractor beam. Let's try to break up the formation a little bit. Yeah. Thank you, Reese. All right, well. Calculate. Calculate. An auto tractor beam token. It's doing the one forward here. And in a tractored state with one less agility. Yeah. Will that matter to Torkoal at this point? Is he range three or is he range four? He's not equipped with a turbo laser, so. <laughs> <laughs> well, it does, I mean, it, it, I mean, it does make. Oh, whoa, hot dice. Club blams. Range three, obstructed. Well, calculate, just take one more shield on poor IGB. That was improbable. All right, half laying it on. This one. Four dice from IG. Mm -hmm. Oh, gets the one. One was enough. Right. Torkoal, see if he can reach. Now he's... Does he have a shot? He does. So there we go. Making yep. some use out of that tractor beam. Canceling Jack's uh, defense. One. One hit. This is not as much here. It's really hard to get that to Ooh. to matter. To be able to capitalize on that, you really want to be have the big Bull heavy shots. Bit, or have a big heavy hitter right. following your tractor, which will come up a lot better with uh, Ketsu being able to get that auto tractor yeah. on if, on before. So you think it would have been preferable then for uh, Reese to maybe have shot his, his primary weapon at um, Jack instead of the I tractor? I think so. I think it's he might have played the shield. Game. But we'll see. It's all about position with Ketsu, so we'll see what happens. Still really early, but IG being down three shields. That's yeah. That was and a... on Brendan's side, no damage taken whatsoever. Yeah. It's 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 an upward battle for sure. Yeah. Well, Brendan's approach was fantastic. He caught that IG out just a little bit out of range, yep. a little bit ahead of the pack with yep. Ketsu behind him, and yep. put in some good damage. That was a great round for him. Yep. And the other challenge for Reese is that when he decides to commit on Jack, Jack can regen, so he's got to <laughs> yeah. decide to get him. That one shield <laughs> plink might not have mattered. That's true. <laughs> He's just going to, and he does have the elusive two. Yeah. <laughs> which he's just going to get back when he does a red. Which he's probably going to do next round. Well, actually, the interesting thing, though, white. is if he does that on a, yeah. if he does it on a round where he uses Leia, he won't get the elusive proc, correct? Right. I believe so. Correct. Because Leia reduces the difficulty. And so that means it's no longer, he's no longer executing the difficult red. So I, I believe, believe, I believe so. that's correct. Yeah. It's a tricksty little Jack Porkins out there. I like it. So if you're Brendan, do you just, not care about actions and just go over the rock. Uh, you try to get a situation in which I think that you they can coordinate can, I think Jack. He can see that that IG is doing some kind of a reversal. I would think possibly, or I don't know. You just want to concentrate fire as much as you can. I feel like Ketsu wants to bomb in with a three bank here. Yeah, Ketsu is definitely coming in next round. She's going to be uh, somewhere up in the. Yeah. In that area, of yep. course. And that's going to be a no uh, no fun zone. Yeah. If she ends up getting bigs in arc, she could potentially put him on a rock yeah. and then focus on uh, Garvin. Yeah. But knowing that, Brendan can also do three banks and maybe block it. If he's, yeah. If he's feeling like that's a good move for him. But half having to move first is the potential he's got to figure out. Yeah, but, you know, with half, half really doesn't have to move. One bank. 
So just as the one bank bump. Okay. The sacrifice. Brendan today representing Gonk and mm -hmm. GRX. It's a cross faction player. A lot of love. There's yeah. enough love to go around. I gotta ask him if there's no Admiral Oshell on the board right now. He's, I, I don't think that's true. I think is he got it hidden away? We can't I, see him. I've seen I've seen Mr. Oshell is in the building. Okay. So he's you know it is a big table. There's camera doesn't cover everything. <laughs> Could be out, Mr. O'Shell might have, uh, or is it Colonel O'Shell? I believe. Is it Colonel? I believe. Okay. <laughs> I believe I'm I not holds, sure. I believe that Tortoise holds the rank of Colonel. <laughs> My apologies, Colonel O'Shell. Okay, so look at that. Doesn't care. Does not care about Ketsu coming in. It's like this is the place to be. If he well, maybe Brendan's decided this is the round. If I can't dodge it, I might as well put three range one X wing shots in there. You know, Jack might do something crazy like a three bank over the rock and get into range one. It's still nine. It, that would be twelve dice. <laughs> that would be a lot of dice. <laughs> Especially because if uh, if if Garvin fires first, he can pass the focus yeah. to Jack, even if he loses his action. Yeah. All right. Is that well, enough? Yeah, so right past I don't that know rock. If that's enough. So potentially okay. be tractored onto it. If we do a. Oh, got some space turbulence there. Didn't pin down our rocks, but what kind of fanatic does that? What's that? We didn't pin down the rocks with blue tack, but what, oh, kind, I of, know. what kind of lunatic does that? You. <laughs> that's but it's right. effective for situations like that. <laughs> yeah. And if it matters to your list. That's actually a really good tip, though. Like a. It does, if, yeah. If you're playing a list where rock placement is imperative to your list success, you should definitely bring some blue tech so yeah. that you can do yeah. that because it is yeah. really helpful so to have that. Oh, okay. Contraband cybernetics. So we see a sloop probably yeah. or 4K? 4K. Yeah. And uh, Contraband's a great card. It also, that tip works really good for bombs too. Bomb placement, the blue tech on the bombs is uh, okay. really good because those bombs just float around all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so it gets the stress, double calculates. Three bank. Here she comes. Yeah. Here yeah. comes Speed Racer. Here she comes. And She's we're going to definitely see some hostile negotiations ensue now. Yeah, but Brendan's did a great job of making that non-optimal. Yeah. Yeah, she's going to they're going to trade some trade some dice for sure. Yeah, so there we go. However, Ketsu it looks the focus. It looks like that might only be one range one for Brendan. So that's yeah, actually just, but still? Yeah. Still nasty. It'll be interesting whether he's going to concentrate the fire on Ketsu or just wipe out uh, Torkoal. Because he could definitely uh, potentially get rid of Torkoal, but mm -hmm. Ketsu, no way. It's not, <laughs> that's not happening this round. So Brendan's first player, right? That's right. Okay, so is that All range right. one? Here we are, okay. measuring range ones. So in this situation, there's nowhere there's nowhere where Reese can put any of Brendan's X-Wings where they don't all get to fire. So there's another really good turn on Brendan's side because he'll yep. fire first. So even yep. if IG tractor beams Jack, he will yep. have already shot. Yeah. So he's going to get all three X-Wing shots. So another really good round yeah. of fire from Brendan here. All right. So considering... But we'll see. Theoretically, yep. it's a really good round for yep. him. Tr considering options for movement. Elusive and chopper, so there we are. I feel like you want, you got to, the, f the, right, so the fearless. Not going to move him. Okay, so Torkoal's right. going to select Biggs. All right, here we go. Ketsu laying it on. Four dice with Fearless. For four dice. Oh, right. there you go. Fearless. Fearless for four hits. Hey. One. All right. 
Now, right. I mean, there's obviously no point the uh, Shadowcast title not really coming into play now because right, you get you already got the tractor token. Yep. All right, here we go. Going to op for Garvin. Yep, so he's going to shoot, looks like Garvin and Taketsu. Spend that focus. Makes sense. This is exactly how Brendan wanted that list to go down. Ooh, that's exactly not what. So Jack's now firing range two into Ketsu with the focus that he got from Garvin. Ooh, oh. hot fire. Power It's down. a bloodbath of a round. I think he's going to spend the focus for that one, or... He's going to take the two damage and save the evade for the, th the next attack. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Ketsu taking some heat. There goes IG. So, range two into Porkins. So he's going into, yeah, he's decided to go into Porkins' primary. He's got to calculate. He's got a lot of crits. Leaving it like that. All right. Oh, that's looks like some blank dice. Mm -hmm. All right, he's doing okay. the elusive. So spending his elusive charge. Focus. Okay. Good use of elusive there. Yep. And these two pros doing a great job of letting us know what's going on. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. There goes Tober. Yeah. I'm just going to do a little more work on Ketsu. I mean, on IG. Looks like two hits and a crit. Yeah. Hanging on those calculates just for that occasion. Well, it's a good thing he held okay, on to them. Okay, well, there you go. Just denying damage. Nothing happens. Good All thing right. It's a good thing that Reese held off on that. Otherwise, he would have been eating a crit. He sure would have because his shields are gone. Mm -hmm. That's Torkoal, I guess. Mm -hmm. Torkoal into Biggs. One more on the big man. All right, here goes zero agility, I mean, zero initiative value, bigs. Mm -hmm. Two hits. So he'll spend that focus and focus, still take one. Take so that was, one. I'd still say decidedly in Brendan's favor. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Even with, you know, bigs not being erased <laughs> before he could fire, it's, it's really difficult, though, with the three ship build. Yeah. To be able to do that. And he's got Leia this next round. Yep. Yeah. He's got Leia. All right. Doing a little bit of planning. Just a little breather between the rounds. Tons of time left. All right. So let's have a look at what our other our players have as their other options for today. Mm -hmm. So... Rendon has got his Rebel Beef that he's playing at the moment. He also brought along a really nasty Chertek Seer uh, Vulture Swarm. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm sure our producer Travis is happy. He's not having to uh, mark an Tracks. eight ship list yeah, at the exactly. moment. And then he's got as his uh, third list, he looks like he's got an FO uh, Tie Swarm Extravaganza going on. That's an interesting list. It's with the... With the Generic silencer and uh, some Zeta and Epsilon squad FOs and SFs. That's a six ship list. What? Nice. That's so that is a all right. Interesting. Then Reese he calls this one his scum garbage list. <laughs> all right. 
And then he's also got a Separatist list. He's got a Darth Maul Chertek and uh, looks like a bunch of other uh, vultures in the mix. And then his third squad, it looks like he's got uh, some Jedi with with support of uh, N1 and a Y-Wing. That's an interesting four-ship list. Nice. Yeah. So if these players do make it back on stream later on today or tomorrow, they might be flying totally different ships. You'll be like, this is a different tournament. No PTL Open. That's the same same guy, same tournament. Just crazy stuff. Yeah, we were talking about the variety of lists there that you know each yep. player brought three completely unique and interesting lists that are... Yeah, which, you know, second edition X-Wing, you get a lot of that. So yeah. that's fantastic. It's really healthy for the game. And so you think in Leia, you think he's definitely doing Leia this round. Definitely can. Yep. But, but so where can... Talon rolling? Can you take it? Yeah, I was going to say, can you take advantage of that anywhere? Mm -hmm. It looks like they would... Because this is exactly where Ketsu and uh, Torkoal want to be. Right in, right in a knife fight. That's how they like it. IG with the auto blaster, he yeah, loves that too. Absolutely. But and I don't think Reese is going to be able to complete a five K on Ketsu, so I doubt he'll do that. Yeah. Like he's just going to one forward and and bump and fearlessness somebody. I think. Yeah. But he's taken so much heavy, uh, heavy damage. Yeah, he took a lot of damage on that exchange. Mm -hmm. Okay, so he has used Leia. All right, Leia. She's off. Three charges spent. All right. All right, doing a little bit of uh, pivoting around. Okay, so Brennan's going to close foils and rotate. All right. All right, here goes Torkoal. Just... Get into the knife fight. He just wants to point well, his not gun gonna drop where he wants it to be. Because that would not work for that him. That would have been hilarious. Well, but I should say he would have had to have done it in the previous Yeah, he round. would have had to have done right. the system That's phase. Right. So. so he's just going to... I think he's just going to point it yeah. into the into the area where ships may be and make his choices later on. He's going backwards. He I think pointed. he suspects maybe some Talons and, and K-turns, yeah. So he's doing a rotate and linking that for a focus. And he pointed back. Interesting. Okay, so big so, uh, 4K. I right. don't think that clears. I that's Brendan's got a hell of an eye if that actually makes it. It yeah. is. Oh, yeah, he does he clear does it. Brendan. Well, there you go. Brendan's, done. Brendan's no slouch apparently. Oh, I never thought he was. I just, <laughs> no. I just didn't think that. No, cleared. but that's that was amazing. That was awesome. Yeah. I love that if that clears. Yeah, that's, that's spicy that's great. if it does. Yeah. That's some, some amazing rule of 11 calculating right there. Oh, it does clear. It does Beautiful clear. maneuver. It does clear. Just Nicely by, done, Brendan. Just by millimeters. Yeah. Nicely done. All right, and being a white, he still gets an action. There yep. he goes with the focus. Garvin just gonna do one straight. Gonna deny Ketsu an action. Oh, okay. With the barrel roll. Okay. I think he wants to make room for Jack's talent roll. Okay. Yep. Oh, to his left. Okay. okay. Oh, okay. so Brendan Tal uh the reason why Brendan Barrel rolled is he didn't want to get put onto a rock when Ketsu bumps him in the Right, early. right. He's just fully conscious of yeah. board state. And plus now uh, Jack gets to face down IG. 
with right. an action. Right. So, elusive not recharged because mm -hmm. it's a white. Well, he does get an action, which is always nice. Oh, yeah. Here comes IG. Mm -hmm. Limping back into the fight, into auto blaster mm -hmm. range. So, let's see if he can do something. He's going to double calculate? Yeah. Double calculate. All right, so there we go. Ketsu just doing a one. Okay, well, look at that. Oh, I think he clears because of the barrel roll. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, not, not fun times for. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, Poor because Ketsu. you want to rotate, but you want to evade. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, that rotate is always what you never want to do with Ketsu. Yeah. So he's just going to take it. He's just going to tank it. Hope and he survives and he can 5K contraband next round. Yeah. Okay, right. so he's going to PS0. Torkoal is yeah. going to PS0. Yeah, bigs. So... Yeah, out of range for Ketsu's effect. It was still worth checking because he could theoretically have done it if that was range one. Double crit. I feel like you want to say that focus for defense. Offense. Oh, yeah. He's so so beefed out. Yeah. Brendan's happy to take the yeah, two shields, he said. Shields. He really wants to see if he can kill Ketsu this round. Yeah. Get a tractor, but to no effect because it's not two tractors. Mm -hmm. Look at that again, flying, cat, flying gentlemanly. Yeah. Reese pointed out that that was an obstructed shot. Brendan should have had an additional die. They corrected it. Class axe all around. All right, Garvin ripping into the side. Ooh, Two nasty. hits and a crit. Oh, Ooh, that's what he needed. That's what Reese needed to see. Oh, well, Craig's still going through. That's yeah. never what the ship wants. Fuel leak. Oh, Ooh, boy. This is a bad round to get fuel leak. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's an unfortunate round to get a fuel leak. Orkins on IG. Hit crit. He's going to save his focus. Uh, he's going to calculate for one. Just Evades have not been crit. going oh, this is way. Oh, another fuel, fuel leak. leak. Oh, man. Yikes. Well, at least all of Reese's fuel leaks are gone now. Uh, yeah, he's got those taken care <laughs> of. Right? There's a silver lining. It's just like... After you suffer critical damage, suffer one damage and repair. Well, at least you won't get the, the chain of that happening on the same ship. Yeah. That could have been nasty. That could have been extra nasty. This is going to auto blaster into Jack. Yeah. That would be. He wants to do something before he dies. Yeah. Auto blaster. Oh, he's going for primary instead. Oh, he's going for the four dice. Okay. Just staying with one. Staying with one. Yeah. Yeah. So All right. Now, Triggers. Now he's going to use the auto blaster. So extra because of bullseye. Yep. Range one bullseye. And that's a worth calculating. And marksmanship makes that into a crit. So calculate for the hit, and then marksmanship for double crit. Okay. And Jack takes all of it. Oh. Okay. Console weapons failure. Fire, weapons failure. So that's well, more the kind of results that Reese was hoping to see. Yeah. Yowza. 
Well, you got to have a little bit of a trade. It was a little one-sided so far at this point. Mm -hmm. Ooh, hit crit. Nice. Oh, denial. that's what he needed. Okay. Torkoal range two at bigs. Pa pow. Focusing ben, for two. Yeah. No reason not to. We know that he, Brendan's going to attack. Double oh, evade. Bigs evades it all. All right. Zero initiative bigs. No. Did they forget Hef? I think they skipped Hef. No, Hef, Hef fired already. Hef Oof. did fire already? Yeah, he did. Uh, that's when Ketsu rolled triple evades. Okay. Oh. All right. All right. Well, there that's you unfortunate. Go. Three damage up. Poor Ketsu. Pabam. Bye bye. Goodbye. Keystone of the list. It's up to you, Torkel Mux. You and your proximity mine. <laughs> Yowza. Yeah, that's tough for Reese because, I mean, I understood his approach was nice. It was interesting. It's just that, that, that exchange with his Ketsu, he just took way too much damage for not enough oh, yeah. back. And that IG just getting caught out just one round too mm. early by itself and taking yep. way more damage than it should have yeah. in that range three engage. Yeah. But, you know, Brendan's is, is wall of fire. He's... Yep. Focused everything down. You yep. know, he was very, very, very good approach. Very efficient, very very solid efficient approach. Yeah. Target priority as well. Yeah. So, yeah, the IGs without their crazy mechanics that, that they used to have with the glitter stim and the fire control system and the heavy yeah. laser cannon and the auto thrusters, just yeah. like the the passive mod denial. It's just like okay, yeah, it's almost like they FFG gave the IGs the uh, uh, two point nerf hammer the same that they did with the jump master it's like you, the, you've won world so yeah you can't do that again <laughs> yeah that's true it, it, it definitely we we were all like really excited about seeing the potential of seeing three of them in the list yeah but yeah that's nothing really to get excited about no because you can't put anything out. on them <laughs> you can put like one yeah. upgrade amongst three yeah, you can put yeah you can put a couple things on them but you know let's let's Maybe Z95 might be a better choice. <laughs> really? An extra Z95? <laughs> Possibly. Maybe a mining guild tie. Let's do that instead. Yeah. Let's see what happens. So, right. I mean, I think you you drop a proximity mine just because. I guess, yeah. There's no reason not to. Except, uh, yeah. He's doing it. I don't think there's anybody going over there. Nope. Maybe IG will land on it to just <laughs> hopefully <laughs> say I've had enough of this. No, I think IG's going to sloop. Okay. Rotating, zero stop. And now he gets a stress. And big, Brendan puts the first stress, stress down of the game. Hey, has this guy been on stream before? Where do you get a big stress token? Okay. No stranger. A high level play. All right. Uh oh. Here comes Here comes Torkel. Well at least he'll be able just, to make half PS zero. He's just or I zero, whatever you want to call it. Now. Uh, well, he's gonna be able to do somebody, but I probably wants to do a, I don't know. I don't know what to tell. Do you focus link or do you like focus link well, rotate or do you definitely just, he's gonna be he's no, just gonna he's focus not even, he's just gonna keep it pointed that way. Okay. Just going to be able to give the benefit. He recognizes he's a support chip. He's just going to... Oh, he might have tagged him. Just keep it pointed back. Nice. He tags it. Oh, wow. Well, there you go. So so two, and he gets one. So two plus one. Oh. oh. Hit crit plus ones. Maximum so, damage yeah, from so Proximity damage. Mine. What, what? Well, Brennan's hot dice betray him. Yeah. And that was Biggs. And that's it for Biggs? Yeah. Kablam. Well, there you go. We were really, you see, don't ever ridicule the Prox mine on Torkoal. That was fantastic. That was, that, was, that was hot. That was amazing.
Now, because the IEGs popped his contraband, yeah, it's going to be tough if he so if he loops here. I think it would hard one into to turn in. Oh, okay. That's what I'm thinking, but who knows? Or maybe he just did a one bank. One bank, hard one. He definitely wants to be in that area so that he can get maximum effect for Torkel's arc uh, effect. But definitely major up against the wall here. And wow. So with Porkins there, is he going to hold it? Is he going to do it? It's He's his got will two will health left. And it will recharge his... Um... There we go. All right, regenning elusive. Takes the stress. Porkins ability proccing. Nice. Doesn't take a damage. Nice. Gets rid of the stress. He can hold it. He's holding it, everyone. Hero of the Rebellion, Jack Bleepin' Porkins. Oh, that flips the weapon failure. Gets rid of that crit. Yeah. Yep. One bank. There you go. So he was really banking on that prox mine. Oh yeah. Because if if um, <laughs> that would have been uh, so bad. If Garvin went sorry, if Biggs didn't hit that prox mine, that yeah. would have been very bad. So bad. Like super bad. Yeah, like hit the inertial dampeners that oh I don't have <laughs> that. So Reese showing white knuckle right, so he's will of steel. He's considering here to calculate or take a lock. Double calculate. He's going for the calculate. Staying with the fuel leak. He's like riding the fuel leak. Like, all right, we'll ride it. Don't worry. So right. I think he's going to focus fire Garvin. Okay, Garvin rolling council fire. Oh, Porkins rolling council yeah, fire. Yeah, it was Jack, yeah. Okay. the range two. All right, three dice up. IG does just one hit result. And evades, go. evades, evades. Do you right. go primary? IGB? Uh, I don't think he's in bullseye, so it, it's only a yeah. three dice attack with the auto blast. Yeah. Yeah, I think you go primary for the four dice, and then if you somehow manage to miss, absolutely, then you at least then you go with the auto buster. Yeah, at least you've got a decent double tap happening. <laughs> Brendan just now realizing that Garvin can pass focuses at just, range three. Just Not reading his two. card now. Just looking at his list. He's still stuck in one point <laughs> mode. Last time he played Garvin. All right, we're good. You think maybe he's contempl contemplating maybe trying to use a tractor? Oh, I certainly hope not. Don't think he's going to be able to get any use out of that tractor. <laughs> I think that's the wrong move, but we'll see what happens. This tractor, like what's he going to do? He's going to tractor him into Torkel's right range beside one? Torkel's range one so that Torkel can <laughs> deliver the heavy hit? I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah, I think you use primary here. You oh, got no, him. he's tractor beaming. Oh, he's going for the four dice tractor. Okay. All right. So there we go for maximum fun. For he's doing it for proximity mine to lay a second proximity oh, mine. Oh, that on. makes sense. And he gets a range. Oh no, never oh, mind. He's going the wrong way. Okay. <laughs> he's going up there. I think he's trying to get him on the rock. Uh, okay. Uh. All right. So if he wanted happened. to remove the range one shot potentially. Well, I don't know. It's just messing with him. Mm. <laughs> Basically, he's just messing with him. Because at this point, what else can he do if he can't mess with him? Yeah, he's, that's really all he's got. So okay. All right, you but can... he could have initiative killed Garvin. Could have. But 
He didn't. <laughs> Fair. This is Reese's list is very, very difficult to. Uh, it's not forgiving at all. It's really difficult to yeah. make work for sure. Oh, Reese is thinking. Oh, he's just considering now about Rolling getting in the, the other way. way. Yeah. But Garvin focuses. No, he's not going to spend. He reconsidered. He's asking. Reese Mines. Take a shield damage on Garvin now. So it'll have the focus for With shooting offense, at IG. Yes. All right, so Garvin shooting IG. Range two shot in arc on the big droid, on the medium base baby. Focus for three. Oh, focus for two. And pass, this, pass it over there for some reason. Mm. Just to because use it. Because he can. Oh. And calculate and no damage. Calculate, reduce. So IG is just dying a little damage. Okay. Yeah, had Reese rolled him left, he would have had the range one on the t on the tractor beam ship, and then he could have dropped the prox mine on him immediately. Possibly, but he around. could have lost IG altogether then. Because Cause he would have been giving up a range one shot. Yeah. Which he no longer now. Yep. Yeah. So, you know, there's really, it's really difficult for him either way, but yeah. it could be that he's going to drop that prox mine anyway. It's just, I always like to uh, get the guaranteed damage by dropping it right on somebody's head. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Being able to, like, the way that he played it so that he pulled it out and just hoped and prayed. Yeah. That, usually that never works out. <laughs> yeah, I try I try not to either. It's always nice when you don't miss with them. Yeah. Because if you don't miss with it, usually, if you do miss with it, you usually wind up ending it, hitting it yourself. I know I know what to do. <laughs> he certainly would have. Yeah. Yeah, he absolutely would have hit it there. <laughs> so... Okay. All right. So they're setting each other's dials. Yep. PTL fun. All right. So I'm, I'm guessing that, uh, you know, that IG, I'm seeing it. I'm going to predict a sloop there. A sloop or a 4K, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, sloop for I, sure. I'm predicting the 4K the sloop. is dangerously close. Yeah. The 4K would probably be a bad thing. Yeah. But I don't know. I think this is going to be really tough for, uh, tough for Reese to get any more happening but that maybe I don't think he's going to be able to get even if he does brought that prox mine it's not going to be of any effect I don't know we're one charge away from Leia being recharged I think I think so yeah so that's not happening but it's still... I mean do you think maybe Garvin just Talon rolls anyway and then yeah. Jack does like a hard two and just everyone goes all in on the IG and just says goodbye. Yeah, I Hef think is so. gonna I mean, one he forward. hasn't touched Torkel at all. And, you know, he's got to just take out IG. IG's going to be stressed. IG's not going to have any mods. Yeah. So he's considering Proxima, I, I believe. He's considering it. Would it have been enough to deter uh, the X-Wing from doing the 4K? I mean, the 3 Talon? All right. Here we go. Not dropping the procs. One straight. Kabam. Remove stress. Mm-hmm. Wings. Oh, okay. Wings staying open, closed. Yep. They're closed, so... so. Okay. Three bank from the Hawk. We'll have some be in good position for yeah, the range one shot. Mine, a range one and a prox mine next round. Yes. But I don't know if that's going to be enough to turn the tide. Turn the tide. He's really got to start removing some ships yes. big time. <laughs> Giving up that shot with the tractor beam 
last turn. Yeah. That was that was heavy. Yeah. I mean, because he's not able to capitalize on it to, you know, with just the torque, just a, a primary hawk turret firing yeah, to follow up nice. is... I feel like he wanted to get out of the range one. He did. Which I understand that, yeah. yeah. But it's, it's with difficult. The, with, the, with the crack shot, would have been almost a high probability of him dying. Yeah. Okay. So, so he's just doing the three bank. Okay. Closing his foils, so I think we're going to see maybe he wants to link. Maybe he just wants access to a boost, yeah. maybe. Porkin still has that console fire. Raging. That's it. Close wings and considering action. He's going to focus. He's going to ride the console fire on two hull. Mm -hmm. <laughs> going for the boost. Oh, that was Garvin. Oh, that's Garvin up yeah. there? Okay, yes, yes. Garvin riding it. So Jack's going after the IG. Yep. You know what? I think. No, it wouldn't have. Never mind. He wouldn't have. He wouldn't have tagged the uh, target lock. Yeah. Fixing console fire. Console fire. Because Garvin could fire first, pass this focus token to Jack anyway. So yep. that's a smart choice. Oh, it's going to try the four K. Yikes! I think it's five forward. Oh, five forward, the big boy template. That makes more sense. So, I don't think You know, that... it's hard to tell from this angle, but the 4K might have actually fit. But it's hard to tell. That rock might have clipped. Mm, that's a really close thing, but that's this suspect. is not a way to win a game, though. Running away. It's like IG's just living... Uh, Leaving all right, and he's like, "Okay, Torkel, you got this. <laughs> See ya." Mm, yeah, you, you got this under control, uh, Torkel. <laughs> you got that under control, Hawk with a primary <laughs> only. <laughs> so what's going on there? Choosing. He's deciding whether he wants to double calculate and just hold under gonna... the fuel leak. Uh, okay, so all right. I think if he'd done the boost, he would have been completely out of arc, or out of range anyway. Calculate 4-2. Ooh, so now he's thinking about whether he wants to fire at Jack who only has two life or has the range one shot. Yeah, range one shot. Focus. So that's three. Okay, so three damage on the big boy, but okay. I mean, if he gets a max roll on that prox mine, like it... Get him at the half points anyway, but... Yeah. You know. Tor Torkel's options next round for really getting out of there... Are non-existent. So shields down on Torkel. All right, shields down on Torkel. Yeah. Kablorm. So Leia is charged. Leia is all so charged. So Hef is going to be able to rotate around if he wants to. Yep. So um, this round, IG has to sloop. Well, what, a hard one boost around that rock at the top of the uh, board? No, I think he's going to be doing a 4K. Yeah. Or maybe a sloop, but I, probably a 4K, but... Yeah, 4K makes the most I sense. I think it's... Yeah, I don't know. Poor little poor little Torkel up there. <laughs> he has been kind of hung out to dry. Yeah, but he's going to drop a Braum, and then I, he's all out of tricks. You know. Yeah. What's he got left? He does have contraband cybernetics. He can pull out a... Hard stop? Three bank out of his butt, but really, what do you want to do that for? <laughs> I think he hard stops. You think he's just gonna zero uh, it? Yeah, why not? I have him crash into the back of you. Of course, that's when that's when Brendan just does a one four with that Garvin and just plants him. We'll see. But what he happens. could PS kill him. 
His, his arc's guess, already backwards. He, he could. Get it focused. You know, okay. Shouldn't write him off. No. We re- we wrote off someone last round and then went <laughs> went for forty minutes of clawing themselves back. And yeah. it's still potential. It's just it's unfortunate that the IG is so far out of the fight right now. Torkel needs some support. Torkel definitely needs support as he is just a support ship, basically. <laughs> <laughs> He needs someone to support, is what you're saying. Yeah, he needs, yeah. I, I need, need a just, ship here to support. Not, uh, <laughs> I'm, not a, I'm not an yeah. ace. Yeah, it's like Mike Ditka out there on the field all by himself. <laughs> taking. It's like, yeah, that's all right. I got it, everybody. Though, to be fair, if you've got if you've got Palhub with a Moldy Crow and an engine upgrade, okay. it kind of feels like an that's ace. A, that's a completely different animal. That's that is like not a 90-point ship. <laughs> that is not Torkoal. <laughs> that is not Torkoal with a prox mine charge and a... Torkoal with a Proximine has killed Biggs already, so... Yeah, he did. All right, so here it comes. It's going for it. And no. It's just happening. Bing, bang. So two, two damage. Oh, he almost killed okay. half. Oof. Okay. Is it wrong of me to have wanted that Ewing to blow up there? No, that okay. would have been... Amazing. That would have been amazing. <laughs> okay, Leia's been propped. So there I goes Leia. think Hef is spinning around. Uh, yeah, definitely. And uh, Torkoal better not have done that zero. But <laughs> <laughs> well, he can Ike, he can PS kill him. He's got one hull left. Uh, okay. And then Jack kills him. Everybody's just kills him. Yeah. Yeah. It's just like okay, yeah. Oh, that was a, that was an interesting thing you did. <laughs> Here's here you go. Bye. We'll see what did happens. Did he remember to open his wings? Is the question. Uh yeah. Come on, Torkoal, get out of there. Hard two. Start to focus. I love to put the two point engine upgrade on this thing, so it, on the Hawk, so it just can do those white banks, but those white bank boosts just to get out of situations like that. But, mm. you know. That's that's not what's happening here. So here we go. IG, it's up to you, my friend. I think he right now is deciding, does he want to focus and then link the rotate the arc, or does he just want to leave the arc backwards? And but the point forward. gap isn't... Uh, isn't Insurmountable. Not, isn't not. It's only 17 points behind, so... And, you know, Jack is on two, and Hef is on yeah. one, so, yeah. you know, Reese is only a couple of shots away from picking up yeah. like 50, 60 more points. He just has to keep his, his IG alive. Yeah. A lot of... Doing the boost. Yeah. Doing the boost. I like that. Gets the stress for that. But he has contraband cybernetics, so... He can always burn that a little next more, turn if he wanted to. He has a little more options next turn. Okay, so okay. Garvin's opening his S foils. Thank you, gentlemen, for putting down the uh, card to show us all. That's actually incredibly ha- helpful. Wings open, increasing firepower. Okay, Jack's doing a white talon because Leia's active. Nothing to try to hold because Leia's active. Yeah, just going to be hold on to that potato of a rock right mm-hmm. in front of him. Yeah, ah. he can barrel. X-Wings can do that now. <laughs> yeah. Which is good, you know. Yeah. It was weird that they couldn't do it before. <laughs> yeah. Oh, two the turn. two turn. Which in which direction? Ship right? Yikes. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. He's going over there. Okay. All Two right. leaks gone. Okay. Torkoal versus the world. All right. He's going to try to... He's picking on Garvin? Oh, oh. he's got no arc. Torkoal's got no arc on anyone. Oh. It's got to be an arc on somebody. 
Oh, yeah, because he's out the back. He didn't do the yeah. rotate at yeah. all. He so, did the, the boost instead. Yeah, he's just going for caution. Well, he's going to yeah. get shut up. He did get himself out of an arc by doing that boost, though, so it's hard to say if that was not the right call. Yep. Yeah. Hold on. One. Yeah, he's good. He's living through that shot. Yeah, so now Renan's checking if he's got bullseye or not, so he wants to spend crack shot. Because if he has bullseye, he'll obviously spend his crack shot on Garvin. Yeah. And bullseye is so tiny. Yeah. So tiny. Deceptively difficult to proc. Unless you yeah. have like six of them. Yeah. Okay, here comes Jack. I mean, Torkoal's holding his own against the entirety of Brendan's list. Hit crit. Here we go. Unless Two dice. Ah! Hit crit go through. So direct will feel real bad. See what the good times are. Crit revealed is a... Wounded. Wounded pilot. So every move could be stress-inducing. Well, luckily, we've got uh, Contraband Cybernetics. We're going <laughs> to... So, yeah, I wonder why he didn't go for a sloop or a K turn on the IG that round to try to get him back in the know, round playing, in the game ASAP. He's ASAP. playing him very, very conservative. Yeah. Mm, maybe he's mathed it out. Maybe this is the way to win. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. Well. <laughs> but he's really, really conservative. I wonder. It's uh, two rounds where IG had no shots going on. He's just off on his own. It's just leaving uh, Torkel to to handle it all. <laughs> He's doing it okay up until that last shot. Now, is Chopper in action? Uh, I'm not sure. I can't remember. I'm we bring up Astro Mo Astromech Chopper. Producer Travis, we bring up Astromech Chopper, please. Can you bring up the Chopper card? Thank you. Oh, right. It is in action. Okay. All right. So he's not going to... Okay, Heal. but does recover a shield though. It's yep. bickety bam. And it only works on non-recurring though. Elusive is a non-recurring charge. Oh right, correct. Okay, yeah, that's the whole. Joke. Yeah, that's the whole so tricky trick. So if he the gets gimmick. two more rounds out of this, <laughs> he can regen his jack up to full health. Or above yeah, half. or above half. Yeah. yeah. No, we're just no. curious if he's going to do it or not because it's the yeah. lulls at this point. So half just stopped. All right. Here goes Torkel. Yeah. It's like, I'm going to go over here, everybody. Stop shooting me, please. Yeah. All right. Wounded is you, take, you roll for stress if you take an action, right? I believe so. That's, I think that's what wounded is. Yeah. Yeah. So if you'd like take an action, it's everything's hard. Yeah. Potentially hard. Focus. You're going to roll for wounded? If they remember. Uh, looks like Unless they... wounded is if you... No, I'm nope, pretty sure. Okay. Pretty sure it's. You just forgot the effect. I don't think it matters whether he's stressed or not this round. That's true. Was, I don't think it know. matters because I don't think Torkel makes it out of this round alive. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna be hard pressed. Yeah. Okay. He is doing it. Okay. He's going for the MMOV. Yeah. Going for that MOV, MOV, MOV. Choppy, choppy. Because chop, uh, cause Garvin's going to force straight with a focus and pass that focus off the check anyways. Yep. It's almost as if this list has yep. synergy. Although, <laughs> Torkel messes with that. Because That's true. That is actually true. He's still going to deny it. And last time, Reese did um, initiative down Garvin to a two. Mm -hmm. Or to a one, so Zero. he can do that. Yeah, well, I'll get it right eventually. <laughs> <laughs> if I just keep saying numbers, eventually I'll get there. So Torco Mux is the anti-Garvin Garvin tech. <laughs> yes. All right, let's see what IG88B pulls out of his hat. Is he going to Morello Evolve, just pop off the board and pop back on to the action? You know, I still haven't played against, played with, or seen that on any table. It's good times, man. The stapler is strong. I gotta try it out. 
<laughs> yeah, see, I mean, if if the uh, if the uh, IG had four K last round, it could have been in range to threaten half and and take half off the yeah, board. But it wouldn't have a wouldn't have fixed his fuel leak. But that's true. It still would have been given some shots. Oh, he put Jack at, at pilot skill zero. Okay. Ooh, that's nasty. Well. Oh, that's okay. it. Hit. Hit crit. Bam, bam. Goodbye, Torkoal. IG against the world. Blam, blam, blam. All right. You even have a shot out of range. So there you go. IG versus the world. Oh, they just recalled. You remember, remembered, yeah. There's a lot going on when you're... There's a, there's a lot going you're on. A lot of, poor poor yeah. Torkoal was under a lot of stress. He uh, had three ships trying to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> his pride was wounded. Yeah. As well as his spirit. So, okay, so let's just see. We If we pop half this round, that's another 25 points. And then we pop Jack. It's tough. It's a, it's a high hill to climb. It's a I high hill to climb. I don't know how it's going to play out, how this is converting to a win in the next four and a half minutes. Because Brendan can 4K Jack, recharge elusive, yeah. hold it, yeah. and then next round regen back up to above half. Yeah. And there's only two rounds left in the game. At Maybe most. three if they're fast. Look, Brendan's ready to rock. He's going for the fast. He's, he's doing the wings. Pivot. Doing a crash. Yeah, it's crash. Time for some X-wing Garvin, surgery. Garvin playing for speed, or Brendan playing for speed, just trying to get as much. Uh, try to regen Porkins as fast as he can. Mm -hmm. I think he'll probably just like get him right out of the fight. He's worth more that way. Well, he should be able to. Oh, he yes. should be able to finish off half this I round. I think that if he just does, yeah, but that's not going to bring him enough. Let's see what happens. Is that a four straight or four K? I would Is imagine. I would suspect. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, why not? Right. You get the elusive charge yeah. back. There's no reason not to. Yep. And it's one in eight chance that you take a damage. Yeah. It's oh, not. he's not going to use his ability. Actually, that does make sense. Yeah. Why risk it? I think Brennan's going for ma yeah. max MOV here. He's playing yeah. for wins. That's fine. You should. You know. I mean, in a tournament setting, you should always try to play for the maximum and optimal position for yourself, and that's exactly what he's doing right now. Yeah. But it's the PTL open, so if you don't make the cut, it's even more fun, because yeah. then you get to play the side events. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, I very clearly weren't looking at the numbers, and I was thinking that Garvin was Jack, so that's my, my bad. Elusive. And then uses action ah, on the turn that oh, he did. He remembers. That's cute. You remember. That's cute. You can yeah. do it on the turn, you get it back. Oh. Yeah. The hero of the rebellion, Jack Porkins. That's amazing. Boink. Regen points. Uh oh. He's going to target lock half. He has to, yeah. Okay, Reese. So he's double calculating because he figures even if he misses, he still has a cannon that he can use. He only needs one damage. Yeah, but the... Okay, so just in range for the auto blaster cannon to work. Because that's risky because 
Yeah. Okay, tractor beam me? Oh, that's nice. Okay. Yeah. Well, he's going to spin the calculator yeah. for the, and that's enough All to right, get him. So, so there Jack's, you go. Jack's finally gone. Sorry, half. Half, half over's gone. Half out. And we've got one more round. One more round. So now we're back to dials. Chickadee Cham. Yep, just pointing out that uh, Porkin's ability does not trigger on crits, which is what you want. It does not trigger on stress? It does not on, on crits. Right, yes, yeah. only on hits. Yep. So it's less than a 50% chance. Yep. Hmm. We're constructing a Porkin's meta. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All hail the new Porkins meta. <laughs> <laughs> Porkins in every list. To be fair, Garvin and Jack together are a wicked combination. They, they synergize are really good. quite lo yeah. quite nicely. Yeah. This is our second list with Garvin in it, but it's really nice to see. I like this Jack build. It's really fun. Yeah. A lot I know of fun. Brendan was saying he was going to use this Jack build in his uh, in his pods down at Worlds. Okay. But uh, I suspect he had some good results with it because it's a good list. All right. There we are, finishing up the round. T time is ra wrapping up. Bickety bam. And just doing a focus, focus, focus. Nig coming in. Just the one straight. Doing the one straight. Double calculate. Just playing it conservative. Do the rock range three. So it's five dice. This is unlikely to hit, but then again, it was he's already, oh, at, he's already right. at half point. So yeah, that's true. Now it doesn't matter anymore. Spend a calculate. Yes, take zero damage. It really doesn't matter. Okay, so it's not obstructed range three. Pow! Yeah. So he's not going to hang on to it. incorrectly doing the numbers. Crunching the numbers. Yeah. He's just going to take the hit. Yeah. See what he can do to gain a little MOV this round. Yeah. Didn't even declare target. Right, just rolling dice. Yeah. <laughs> Number one for 10. All right. And there you Ooh. go. Evades, and that's the game. There you go. Brendan.